So today at 5 a.m. Uh, the Global Game Jam starts and everybody in the house is packing their stuff because we are all going there together. Um, we're going to Kalsam, which is half an hour away. And yeah, we're gonna make one huge spell collective team with 10 team members. <laughs> Let's find out how that's gonna work and what type of game we make. Let's go. Rasmus. Shit, I have two hats now. Bye, house. Is this the game jam? Yeah. We're here again. Nice. Get in. <laughs> oh. Blah blah blah. To locate the building, there is a logo in front of the building, a sign with the letter B. We have no idea where to go. Where? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Yep. Yeah. You go hold it. the other hand and just go like oh. It's beautiful. <laughs> Did I think we're gonna be antisocial. <laughs> so these are the rest of the game jam people, and here on it's all spell collective people. Uh, yeah. shit. I don't know when we finish. What am I doing? Am I typing? It works. So we are back at the house, uh, we started the game jam, I didn't really record that much. Today we mostly did setup, planning and all of that stuff and uh, yeah, I'm probably going to try and start doing a concept artwork overnight. Uh, so we have that tomorrow, at least tomorrow morning, um, so everybody knows what the final product should look like. That's the plan! <laughs> Also this time, because we're a giant team, uh, we have a lot of 3D artists. So we're doing a 3D game and not a 2D one. Uh, yeah, and that is also pretty interesting. So hopefully I can show a bit of the 3D workflow and, that, and stuff that 2D artists can do at a 3D art game jam. And yeah, let's see how tomorrow turns out. Eight hours later. First batch of crazy people are leaving. 
Alright, so it is Global Game Jam Day 2. The opening ceremony yesterday was... If I'm not caring for a tool, it would rust and fall apart, become useless. We would lose it. Interesting. Anyway, we got started on our game and currently we're just waiting for two more people to get ready. And yeah, then we're also gonna drive to Kalsam and then continue on the game. I did a really, really shitty concept artwork yesterday night and this morning. Yeah, just to get everybody on the same page. If you want to learn something from this video, um, then sometimes bad sketches are better than nothing. So, uh, yeah, let's get going. Was it? The red dance. Oh, this is that. So much water. Oh no. Are you filming the film? Yes. spoke about the type of game that we're making so the theme is transmission and the gameplay that we want to aim for is that we have two characters that have to transmit a ball from one player to the other so one player can only hold the ball for like half a second or a second and the other player has to move in that time and then they have to the standing player has to throw the ball to the moving player and um, yeah, the setting that we chose is the two players are parents and the ball is the crocodile baby that they apparently don't want. It's kind of a sad story. The, baby. the upside is it's all just the theater play. All of that is happening on a theater stage um, so we can just make like cool modular blocks and the biggest challenge was finding a way to fuse 2D and 3D because we have a lot of 3D artists um, but we don't have the time to do like two rigged and animated characters so the characters are going to be 2D and everything else is going to be 3D uh, yeah so that's going to be pretty interesting so there will <laughs> probably always be uh, something that to show where you're currently aiming I guess mm -hmm. even though you're not actually Holding a baby or anything? Yeah. So I'm okay. just saying I made one, and uh, so it will need some graphics there. I'm an alligator. I'm a mama, papa coming for you. I'm a the rest of the afternoon was spent making various assets. We started with basic level design, made more art in the form of 3D blocks and created shaders as well as music. Your head is stuck in the baby. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so this is the sexy husband character. And this is his beautiful wife. Maybe I threw away the baby. <laughs> it's the evening of the first day. Everybody's still super focused working on the game. Um, we have basic gameplay ready, which is a really good sign. Um, so the plan for tonight is to maybe start, uh, maybe getting the multiplayer to work. So far on the art side, 
uh, we have <laughs> two creepy characters. Um, I'm probably gonna spend the rest of the night doing interface stuff and hopefully tomorrow I can paint some textures. Well done. Pick up the baby. Uh, just go to it. Closer. So go back and go to it again. Like this. Yeah. How's the animations going? <laughs> Cheers to that. Cheers. <laughs> How's progress on the baby? Mm. Like, like how it's big is going it? very good. Yeah. I cut the baby now and then send the pieces to Raku. Like, like nice. Like, just like, what are you doing? Trying not to <laughs> I have too many, <laughs> too many players on this. On this. <laughs> and uneven amount between them as well. Oh, why are there four players? There's three here and four here. I don't know. <laughs> Mystery man. Mystery. <laughs> Are you excited for the pizza? <laughs> Mark. And then we start at the same position with the same week. Yeah, that is also. Whoops! <laughs> Bye, baby. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Wasn't the rule to not move chairs? I stole the chair. Didn't move it. All right. <laughs> Though we have some weird issues on games machine, but me and Simone just played it and it worked. So it's getting late. We did some levels in the tile editor, which was pretty cool. But, um, we have a definitive list of assets that we just need to polish so we have everything that we need but we still need to assemble everything in one scene so we have a lot of great parts that are working on their own like even the programming the character moves he jumps it's like it's really cool to move around and jump um, but yeah he's just jumping around in an empty unity scene the first group already left and it's like quarter past 12 now so we're gonna leave as well and I think James is taking a quick nap and then he's gonna get back up and implement all the stuff that we did in the last hour and Fabian is even going to stay overnight um, and he's gonna handle the 3D art asset stuff uh, Yeah, and I might do the interface overnight but first it's back to Spell Collective it. We're back at Spell Collective now. I have to talk a bit more quiet because people are sleeping in the next room. Um, two of our artists stayed behind um, in Kalsam and they're still working on stuff. And also programmer Nicholas is still working on the networking right now. Later I might work on the interface a bit more and then try and yeah, get some sleep. Early the next morning. <sighs> but you can be happy because your chair has the ass heating. Mm -hmm. uh, heating. That's uh, true. Ass heating? Yeah. Ass heating in the. Five hours left. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. Well, that's just a recommendation that we have until five. We have a wall that generates and uh, stuff like that. Uh, Beautiful levels being designed. 
Why? It's gone, right? Yes. Where's it gone? <laughs> so beautiful. Two it's... men forcing each other's love upon each other. Next to the baby. Maybe that's why the baby disappeared. Ooh. So what do you get to say for yourself? Um, I'm very tired. <laughs> <laughs> but um, the game is good. What do you get to say for yourself? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, totally agreed. Have we found the baby yet? Walking my baby, 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 baby. <laughs> oh, throw it. Where's the baby? <laughs> oh, damn skirts. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> you're fucked. <laughs> Yeah, the baby's gone. Yeah, okay. 4% for easy, then 20% uh, for medium, and 5% for hard. And then it gradually gets harder and harder until it uh, gets more hard. There is the exit button to say start. Why? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, who else medium 4? Yay! <laughs> okay. I'm safe! Why? Because I had beer and didn't know what to do. What the fuck have you done with it? I can exactly tell you what I've done with it. James? No. I'm going now into the bay. Wow! Well, what kind of shit faces don't have logos? We should uh, make one for Nicholas and then force him to pay like one million. Yeah. Yes. Well, oh, you mean, that's true. <laughs> Say something funny. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Great loading text. No. Say something funny and then. mean to touch your butt. Mm. I think I deleted the folder. What? Yeah. <laughs> you deleted the folder? <laughs> Not in the project, no. Okay. Just in my own photo. Okay. okay. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> Can you uh, check the baby in uh, the... Why is it that newspaper? always when you update stuff, something seems funny. to be gone? Uh, I have no idea, really. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I just shouldn't touch the project anymore. <laughs> Less than one hour, guys. Yeah. You have uh, 20 minutes. What? Yeah. We're going to upload it at 16.30. Why do you throw it? So I'm thinking that we rescued a baby <laughs> and we really don't want to. <laughs> so it was all nice and done to rescue the baby. Now we're actually like, okay, what do we do? With you take it. Oh, you baby? take it. <laughs> dun, da, dun, dun. Joseph, how do you feel about the timer? No time, no time. Rasmus, how do you feel about the timer? No, it's gone, so I'm pretty Where? fine. You can adjust it now. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> Where did you go? 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 you cannot be restless. Oh. But he can be restless. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get the same. Dum, 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 oh, time is gone.
the game jam is over. We finished our game. Not, but it's playable and now we're going home. Thank you.